All right, on to the next mission. Ah. Time to hit their base. Oh no, that's a lot of blood. That's that's way too Come much on. blood. Come on, stay with me. We're almost there. Almost there. Almost there. It's not much further. Don't stop. Don't. Come on. Mm. Cormac! Damn. So what now? Now we finish this thing. We're the only ones who can stop our hands from launching Manticore. It's three of us. Against an army. It's suicide. You're right. But it's what he would have done. Okay. You got any ideas? Just one. Yeah. <laughs> Exotype AST, chain gun, micro rockets, and swarm missiles. It was a plan only Gideon could have come up with. A frontal assault on Iron Stronghold using the two mech suits we found back at the base. Drones would fly us in. After that, we'd be on our own. Sentinel 2 1, still detecting high levels of contamination in the city. We will not be able to get ground forces to assist you. Over. Copy that, Kingpin. Enemy forces are closing on your position. there almost there Mitchell on me no, you on me I got this Ilona we're inside you should be 
right next to the launch pad. Security breach in the silo. All units converge on sector four immediately. Up oh, here they come. Here they come. Swarm missiles ready. Rocket ready. Main gun ready. Unauthorized personnel in sector four. Contact me. Downstairs. My alarm is going off. Fantastic. I'm here. I'm ready. Let's do this. Launch in 
launch in T minus one minute. Had to had to turn off my alarm real quick. <clears throat> Go. Okay. Destroy it! Destroy it! Stop the launch. I'm gonna get you out of here. Stay with me. This one. Sentinel 2-1. City defenses are breaking. Atlas troops are collapsing. We need to know the status of that launch. Copy that, Kingpin. The launch has been aborted. Repeat, launch is aborted. Did you copy? Kingpin, come in! Elona, are you receiving? Damn it. Cut off. We need to move. They're gonna hit this building any minute. Setting you down. I need you to try and walk, Mitchell. I need to find some light. Oh, Hello, shoot. Mitchell. Oh, no. Fucking move. I could ask the same of you. He's hacking into our exos. Come out of ammo. You rely too much on those things. So I can't fire. Over. What I have started won't end with me. Uh, it's bigger dirt. than me, and it's certainly uh, bigger than you. Fucking gun! You think I'm oh, a monster? Shit. That's only because you don't have the conviction to do what's necessary. Necessary? The attack on America, unleashing Manticore, killing thousands of innocent people. I'm saving the world from itself. When there's no one left to challenge Atlas, there will be no more wars. There had to be sacrifices along the way. Yeah, twisted fucks throughout history have used the same argument. I don't know who stopped the launch. They'll bring this entire building down on top of you. I could have killed you in the prison camp. I could kill you now. But I won't. I'm not a monster. Mitchell, 
Try to hit the release on your exo. Now mine. It's not working. There's no time. If he gets away, this will all have been for nothing. Go. No! Don't let Irons get away! Hurry, there he is! There he is! I'm gonna get you! Uh, yeah! Fucking asshole! I'm gonna get your ass! Get on it! Motherfucker! Bitch! Oh, I'm gonna get you! I'm gonna get you! Oh, ah! Motherfucker! Get your ass over here! Mitchell, pull me up! I can't! You ruined this arm! There's only two choices. You either pull me up, or this whole building goes down and we go down with it! Mitchell! What are you doing? What are you doing? Mitchell! I gave you that arm! Mitchell! I gave you a second chance! Fuck! You! See you in hell! That knife hits you in the head. I've got you, mate. Ah, he got out. Nice. Was only gonna end one way for it. Irons gave me a second chance, and I gave it back. He thought he could solve the world's problems. If he did have the answer, he took it with him to the grave. But he was right about one thing. This wasn't the end. It was just the beginning. Atlas. we go that is it everyone call of duty advanced warfare oh, exactly what i expected call of duty some added abilities look at that say i always enjoy this story mode I don't know if I want to play the multiplayer. I'll probably test it out. Might not record any footage. Maybe I'll record footage. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. Alright. That's it. That was the story. So far, really enjoyed the story. Didn't like that sometimes I was shooting enemies. They were just sponging the bullets. Especially headshots. I think headshots should be... Uh, instant kill regardless if they try to bullshit us by saying well the enemies have stims well you can't stim a fucking headshot wound there's no way to stim a headshot wound so hell with that uh, it's a video game what what am i to expect from a video game realism It's a nice little joyride. I really like the characters in this game. I like that they're modeled after their voice actors. It's pretty cool. But there we go. Another Call of Duty. Another great campaign completed.
Yeah, I'll record some of the multiplayer. I'll do that. Uh, <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna stick with it. I don't highly doubt uh, this is gonna be one of those games that I keep going back to for the multiplayer. Uh, my brother, he loves Call of Duty, so I know he's definitely gonna be into the multiplayer. But me, I, I'm sorry, but multiplayer just got old for me. I mean, Titanfall was possibly the last game that I would do multiplayer like this on until I see something fresh, something new. Uh, Halo Master Chief Collection is right around the corner. I'm interested in that multiplayer. Um, even though I already been there and done that, and everything is gonna be uh, remastered, so like the multiplayer maps from the original Halo 2 is supposed to be remastered. And I, I mean, come on, it's four games in one. So yeah, all four Halos in one with the different multiplayer maps from each of those games. So that's something I'll definitely jump into. Probably dedicate some time to. I didn't see myself dedicating a lot of time to Halo 4's multiplayer either. I don't know, maybe I'm. Maybe it's just multiplayer games in general, like this, shooters in general, I'm just tired of. I don't know, that's just me. That's my point of view. I think I'm getting tired with first person multiplayer shooters. Games I'll go back to Halo Master Chief multiplayer and Titanfall. Definitely go back to those. But, um, I don't know. I want a third person perspective. I like seeing. That's that's one of my biggest gripes with first person games. Is that you customize your character with all this fancy equipment and stuff like that. And you're not able to see your customized character. Destiny, for instance, I would have loved to play that game in third person perspective because of my customized armor but you're tied to first person view at least make it an option in these first person shooters to to have that option to make it third person so I can see my customization and then after that you don't you're no longer categorized as a first person shooter you're just categorized as a shooter shooter Take that whole first person, third person, you know, genre or categorization or whatever you want to call it. Let's throw that out the window and give people the option to play in both perspectives. That would be cool. And then when you pull out a sniper rifle, for instance, maybe you go into like a first person mode so you can snipe. That makes, that makes sense. I hate customizing my character and not being able to see the equipment. That's my biggest gripe with first person shooters. But yeah, I'll give it a shot. I'll give the I'll give the Call of Duty Advanced Warfare a shot. The multiplayer. We'll see what's what. We shall see. <sighs> so what's the next Call of Duty gonna be? Is it gonna be Ghost 2? Cause I, 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 I have a feeling that there's gonna be a, a continuation of that story. The way that, uh, that game ended. I don't follow the lore and any other stuff that's out there, but I wouldn't mind playing a continuation of Ghost 2. Just the campaign. Sell the campaign for $20 or $30. Sell it for $30. Campaign. That's what they need to do. Split it up. No, make a different version for just people that want to play the campaign and then. For 60 bucks, 
to include the campaign and the multiplayer for for those people that are more into the multiplayer. Don't just make the multiplayer its own standalone game. I say make the campaign and multiplayer a sixty dollar retail game, and then for people that just want the campaign experience, just make it a thirty dollar game. You know that that because I like I just said I. I'm not a huge fan of the multiplayer. I, I mostly play Call of Duty games for the campaign. Surprisingly enough, I'm the type of person that just plays these type of games for the mo for the um campaign. But I I hate shelling out sixty bucks for a six seven hour campaign. That's my problem with this. Like they're selling me this game even though I only want to play the campaign. 60 bucks. So. Yeah. $30. And I will buy every freaking Call of Duty that comes out every year for the campaign. $30. And here we go. Ooh, nice scene. Nice picture. go there we go that is it that is it everyone i hope you enjoyed until then i'll see you next time peace